Hi, this is Josh Matthews of Village News Sports. Post game report Thomas Dale pulls out a close one tonight, defeating Dinwiddie 20 to 13 to improve to 7 and 2 on the season. I'm here with senior quarterback Khalid Morris and sophomore linebacker Max Oxendon, who made the big play at the end of the game and recovered the fumble that enabled Dale to seal the win after a crazy fourth quarter. Um, Khalid, talk about the game tonight. Uh, a lot of teams have been stacking the box against you lately, which means you have to make more throws. Um, talk about what you've been working on and how it's gone so far. Yes, sir. Well, they still, well, like, like you said, they stacked the box, and that lets, that lets me open up the passes. That, pa that opens up the pass game for them stacking up the box. And that's why we've been so successful. All right, so for the, for the play on the last play of the game, take me through what happened on that play, um, what you saw, and how you got to the ball. I just saw Phil break, break the, uh, through the line, and I just went for the ball. I saw it pop out, and I, I went to it. Now, you seem to always be around the ball. You're only a sophomore, yeah. but when I've watched you play, you always seem to have a nose for the ball. What do you attribute that to? You know, since I was a little kid, I, I had a nose for the ball. <laughs> All right, so... You guys uh, started off 0-2, you've now won seven games in a row, heading into a very important week for Thomas Dale playing Matoka. Um, talk about that, talk about how important it is to go ahead and finish off the season with the win and beat Matoka. Yeah, it's very important. It's very important that we get this win because we beat Matoka, we got, a, we, got, we got two home games, two important home games that we need to get. Beating Matoka, that, that's 8-2 and two right there. That's, it's pretty good to get two home games back to back. It's going to give us confidence. So you're you're new um, on varsity. Um, and, and like, so what's it going to be like for you to play Matoka? It, you know, it's become a very big rivalry with uh, the students at each school. Yeah, I know. Uh, sitting in the bleachers last year watching us lose by one point was, I mean, it was heartbreaking. Even though I was on the sideline watching them. But this year we're going to come out and we're going to smack them in the mouth like we always been doing these past seven games. All right. Finish the season strong. All right, great. Well, this is a post-game interview with Khalid Morris and Max Oxendine, Josh Matthews, Village News Sports.